Scott Morrison to make his final set piece pitch to the nation today, warning voters against change. His address to the National Press Club will focus on the ideology of the government's record and the risk of Labor. Political reporter James O'Doherty is following the Prime Minister. James, first stop, a pitch to local voters in Western Sydney up early this morning. Up early at Sydney's uh, flower markets here in the seat of Reed with local candidate Fiona Martin. Scott Morrison uh, talking to the flower salesman and the other produce salesman here at the markets. Very early start for Scott Morrison. He's been almost finishing his campaign where Bill Shorten started, curiously enough, uh, here in the seat of Reed, uh, getting selfies with uh, plenty of people. Most are happy to see the Prime Minister, especially all the ones that are getting their photos taken with Scott Morrison, a bit of a chat about local footy teams and about the Shire, as you would expect. Scott Morrison really pressing the flesh until uh, the final day of the campaign uh, goes forward. This before travelling to the nation's capital to address uh, Australia in a National Press Club address, the final set piece of the campaign, where Scott Morrison will be focusing on ideology, the importance of freedoms, aspiration and the dangers of change to Labor. He'll be arguing for essentially more of the status quo that we've seen under the government, what he argues is the coalition's strong economic narrative, not too much policy that we've seen from Scott Morrison during this election campaign, very much a campaign focused on the fact that he says the coalition has brought the budget back in the surplus for next year and that that's how we can pay for the services that we require, Scott Morrison said, to make his uh, final uh, set-piece speech to voters at lunchtime today. And while he's not giving up on the seat of Reid, which uh, Labor are the red-hot favourites through Sam Crosby to win that seat, um, where Flemington Markets, of course, is located around uh, the, uh, the area of uh, Five Dock and, and further west from there. But uh, James Scott Morrison yesterday targeting the Chinese community. Yeah, so this is important in the seat of Reid as well. Reid has a high uh, proportion of Chinese voters, so Scott Morrison at a Chinese media and community event last night targeting that community, saying that Australia uh, and, and China are, are close friends, emphasising the coalition's record in maintaining that relationship, also highlighting Michael Daly's comments, which the Liberal Party has uh, information on that says uh, those comments were harmful to the Labor Party in this part of the world. So uh, the Chinese community, an important aspect of this seat of Reid. Liberal sources that I've been talking to are seeming a bit more confident about Reid. Labor uh, not counting this one as a win just yet. And it will be one that goes right down to the wire and could go either way on election night.